so now let's see uh, a real infra trade uh, which which was a sell call in the morning the sell call uh, got activated at 375.3 that is the price that is the equity price so what you do is uh, once the equity price of real infra comes to 375.3 you will short an real infra contract in futures at the market price so what will be the stop loss for 375.3 the stop loss is 378 so now what i have done is uh, now the current price is 368.50 so it has already made its uh, target 5 and even target uh, 7 also uh, sorry final target also i think so now i will just take uh, the equity chart of uh, rel infra this is the equity chart of rel infra and uh, simultaneously uh, rel infra we have the futures chart also so this is the chart our entry for rel infra was 375.3 so what i'll do is i'll just uh, put it in photoshop again So let's open rel infra chart. So that is the futures and this is the equity. Let's open both. So I'm just dragging this uh, futures chart to the right side. So I'll just put it here. And this is your uh, equity price, equity chart. So I'll just put it here. Uh, just let me expand and show you the entry price that is the sell call the sell call price was at 375.3 let's say 375 so it got activated here so the corresponding price is 375 only and uh, now it went down to 368 so this is then 368 slightly uh, near 368 so we can just see uh, calculate approximately what will be the uh, profit in this 375.3 minus 378 so that, that is roughly 2700 rupees considering uh, 1000 rupees is a lot size for well infra so as soon as your uh, trade comes to 375 and falls below 373 you keep changing your stop loss also So you can see 378 was the stop loss so this was the stop loss uh, so we didn't have to worry because the price kept on uh, going down now let's uh, check another uh, chart we can take uh, Bath Airtel or uh, any other chart. Or let me complete uh, the next script in the next clip. So let's take. Supla, Supla or uh, JP Associates or DLF, 